Hello students, in the today's session, I execute one more Android journal program. That program name is Develop an Application to Illustrate WebView. What is WebView? WebView is a system component powered by Chrome that allows Android apps to display web content. Today, we are going to develop the simple program to demonstrate web view where we are creating a simple browser this browser contains a web view control a text field and a button so user will enter his url in the text field and here click on a button upon click on a button the enter web page and display in the web view so first go to the file go to the new and go to the new project and here select the empty activity then go to the next and here my application name is web view web view then go to the finish here processing is running wait for some time So here I creating a design then go to the activity main.xml Here I take one text plane take it and drag it and here I take one button take it and drag it and here I take web view take it and drag it so here I change the text of the button I here take the go So go to the infer okay and this is our XML code then here first we take a permission because of without permission it cannot work then go to the manifest and here user permission dot android and here you select the android dot permission dot internet ok here I got the permission then directly go to the main activity dot java so here public class main activity here main activity is our class name extend app Compound activity. We have declared here two components button one and edit text one. So I start the writing code here. To here button is B1 and edit text is e d1 this is simply a declaration then even 
वन मोर कंपोनेंट वी हैव डिक्लेयर हियर वेब यू वेब यू डब्ल्यू वी वन so here then in on create method we have finding the reference to button in the gui then we have view and edit text so the references of gui components we are getting in this particular code so first we have getting references of button so here b1 is equal to in bracket button find v by id find v by id method which used to get a reference of a button by using its id to in this method passing the id of a button so here r dot id dot so here go to the main activity go to the design here our button here id is button here see the id is button then button then semicolon okay then same way we have getting the reference of edit text then go to the ed1 is equal to edit text edit text find view by id r dot id dot then here go to the our design code then here you see the id of edit text edit text then again same way getting the reference of web view as well so here wv1 is equal to in bracket web view find view by id r dot id dot then again go to the in design code here id is web view so here web view then go to the so here once we have references of three gui components in the coding the next thing what you are doing this we have setting a listener on button b1 because of on click a button the url which is enter in the edit text to be display on the web view control so here setting the on click listener here and we have passing so here b1 dot set on click listener we have passing anomalous inner class to it handle the event so here new dot new 
view dot on click listener so here we have creating a anonymous class which is implementing on on click listener the next in on click method which is execute when you click on a button and inside the button what you doing when you click on button b1 then first getting the url which enter in the edit text box by the user to get the information we have use ed1 that is our reference variable in the coding so here string url is equal to ed1 dot get text dot to string semicolon we have called the method get text so this is method which read text from the edit text control then we have convert that into the string by default get text will not given a string to convert that string we have using to convert string and that is stored in the url once we have the url enter by the user that url or a resource and that need to be display the web view then next first you setting the certain settings of web view control so here w v1 dot get setting dot set loads images automatically in bracket true by default images are not loaded in the web view control to make it load images we have to make it true load images automatically to be true okay then wv1 dot get setting dot set javascript enabled then again true even javascript is default if you having javascript code in web view that code was not executed if you have executed that code then wv1 dot get setting dot set javascript enabled is true then next wv1 dot set scroll bar style in bracket view dot scroll bar underscore inside underscore overlay we have adding this scroll bar to our web page and without scroll bar you cannot scroll the web page you cannot scroll up and down or horizontally without scroll bar so that is adding this scroll bar once you do all the settings then wv1 dot load url and here i pass url lastly we 
can load the url or page which wanted to which wanted by the url then here i execute this code go to the run app then here i select the pixel api 21 then go to the okay wait for some time the processing is running so here yes tt p s yes, colon www dot google dot com then go to the button and click it so here i write the what is android okay so here i click the here link the android page will open okay suppose if you click on any link inside the web page if of the web view that page will not be loaded in some time inside your web view in order to do that you need to extend your class from web view client okay then here i extend one class private class my browser extends web view client okay at override at override here public boolean so here private class here my class name is my browser extend web view client at override public boolean should override url loading web view view comma string url and here url dot load url so this is our method and return true and here i add wv1 dot set web view client in bracket new my browser so here my class name is my browser so here i use the my browser i run this code go to the run option and here again i select the pixel api 21 and go to the okay so here processing is running wait for some time
so here https colon www dot google dot com click the button so here you see the our this is our output if you have any search the information then go to the link and search it okay so like that you execute this program if you have any difficulty please ask me thank you